Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Equity is basically the difference between what you have, meaning all of your assets, and what you owe, meaning all of your liabilities. If you sold all of your assets today and paid off all of your liabilities using the money received from the sale of your assets, the money you'd have left over would be your equity. A balance sheet shows your company's assets, liabilities, and equity on a particular date. Because equity is the difference between total assets and total liabilities, it's also true that total assets equal the sum of total liabilities and equity. As you enter the beginning balances of your assets and liabilities when creating the company file, QuickBooks Online Plus calculates the amount of equity and records it in an equity account called Opening Balance Equity. In addition to the Opening Balance Equity account, QuickBooks often sets up another type of equity account for you called Retained Earnings. This account tracks your company's net income from previous fiscal years. QuickBooks automatically transfers your profit or loss to retained earnings at the end of each fiscal year. If your company is a sole proprietorship, you don't have to add any more equity accounts to your chart of accounts. All of the equity belongs to the company's sole owner. If your business is a partnership, you'll probably want to set up separate equity accounts for each partner. You will want to create a new vendor for each owner or partner. You may also want to create a user for each owner or partner. However, depending on the number of users you currently have available within QuickBooks Online Plus, this may not be a viable option. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.